We're gonna talk about the cycle that can turn you into a cycle. <laughs> With this cycle, I've been through this cycle countless of times, as I'm sure many of you have too. The eyes, Chico, they never lie. If you are blessed by the Almighty. So, with these cycles, this is how the cycle starts. You're introduced to people. Whether you introduce yourself or not, you are introduced by your presence, by the, your way of life, your lifestyle, the way you carry yourself. People are just going to be attracted to you, not just relationship wise, both genders. They just want to be around you. Okay. At first, you'll think, hey, maybe people just like to be around me. It's a positive thing. Yes, it is a positive thing. But they're not around you for positive things. Write that down, write that down! See, in the cycle of the beginning stages, they all love you. Everybody loves you. And then, so, being the person that you are, you're very generous, you know. It's just your natural way of life, as I mentioned. Your everyday regular life is somebody's dream life. Did you ever stop and think of that? Yeah, you blessed. All right, baby, you blessed. Like, when you're so used to doing certain things and moving a certain way, doing this and that with the world, it becomes normal to you. And sometimes you forget it, that what you're doing is not normal. Well, those people don't see it that way. So when the opportunity comes, they're going to sit right next to you, basically like a dog does at the dinner table. They're just waiting for the scraps. And knowing that you are a good person, you're going to feed your dog the scraps. The next part of the cycle, you will become wiser. And then when you wise up to Okay, I was really being these people's friend, but I see that these people only want to be my friend when I have this or that for them. You figure out what the vice is that they want. Usually it's money. Well, the root of everything requires money, so we're just going to say money. But it can be very specific of what people want from you. Okay, so you decide, you know what? Let me take a step back and withdraw. Let me not give so much. Let me just actually be friends with no benefit, nothing at all. We're just gonna be friends. We still have benefit, but I know exactly what you want and I'm not gonna give it to you. The next phase of the cycle starts. You'll begin to be defamed and you will become infamous. And those same people, they're gonna hate you now. I chose my path, you chose the way of the hero. And they found you amusing for a while, the people of this city. But the one thing they love more than a hero is to see a hero fail, fall, die trying. In spite of everything you've done for them, Eventually, they will hate you. Why bother? It went from they loved you to death. They hate you now, like literally hate you. They're going to do everything in their power to prove how much of a bad person you are because you stopped fulfilling their vices and giving them their needs. It wasn't even a need. You were fulfilling a greed. People seeing you as naive and stupid as fuck, basically. You're not stupid as fuck. You just played them. You have to play a fool to catch a fool. Yes, sir! This nigga spitting! And 
and then once they hate you, they're going to try to get other people to hate you. And that also helps you, even though it will hurt you because you might be mutuals with somebody and you'd be like, damn, so that's what they think of me? You don't even realize that your haters are uncovering your other secret haters because they were just waiting on the opportunity to be like, I knew it was something wrong with his ass. It ain't nothing wrong with you. They wanted to be something wrong with you. Therefore, it fulfills and justifies all their insecurities. And then once they realize that you still keep growing and you're still getting stronger throughout the hate, they try to ignore you and act like they don't see you. But you're too getting too big to where they can't ignore you. You're constantly growing. And that just leads to a lifetime of misery for them. And then you want to know something else? More people will become attracted to you as you grow. And the cycle continues to repeat, rinse, repeat, rinse. Unless. There's really no unless. This is just how this life shit go. <laughs> It's an evil world we live in.